to Amazing Aria. Today I'm going to be talking about the United States of America. It is easy to love the United States for all the good things that it has done. Let's look at some of the facts that will surely amaze you. And hopefully you will learn something new today. Did you know that the flag of the United States of America was designed by a 17 year old student? as a school project in 1958. And you gotta be minus. And that's because in 1958, America only contained 48 states. And there were talks about Alaska and Hawaii could soon become states of America. So the student decided to make a 50 star flag. And he gotta be a minus. Can you imagine that? Talking about military, the largest air force in the world is the United States Air Force, a nation of do-gooders. Americans are the most likely people in the world to help a stranger, according to the World Giving Index. Thanks to the firemen, because more than 69% of firefighters and United States are volunteers. Talking about the real Independence Day, the day Congress voted for America to be free from British rule is July 2nd, 1776. July 4th is when John Hancock signed the Declaration of Independence. Have you ever wondered what's on the fifth floor of the Supreme Court building? Take a wild guess. Don't worry, let me tell you what's on the fifth floor. On the second floor is the coat room, and on the fifth floor, there's a basketball coat. And sometimes, jokingly, the basketball coat is considered the highest coat in the land. Funny or what? Talking about the Statue of Liberty, seven rays on the crown of Statue of Liberty represent seven continents. Talking about the dollar bill, did you know that it contains several hidden images, including a spider in the upper right hand corner? Talking about great heights, the world's tallest roller coaster will soon open in Orlando, Florida in 2020. It's gonna be 520 feet high roller coaster, the tallest in the world. Did you know that Alaska was purchased from Russia in 1867 for $7.2 million and is the largest state by land area? Did you know that 100 acres of pizza is served in the United States every day? That's a lot of pizza and it's also the number one favorite fast food in the United States. Did you know that the first internet connection was established between the University of California and the Stanford Research Institute? Did you know that Chicago is the birthplace of the first ever Ferris wheel? Georgia is the birthplace of miniature golf? Did you know that Atlantic City is home to longest boardwalk? in the world. Did you know that the Pentagon is the largest office building in the world? By area width, 17 miles of corridors. It has five sides, five floors, five ring corridors per floor, and a five acre central plaza. And that's why it's called a Pentagon. Did you know that Harvard was the first university of the United States of America? Do you know that the biggest bill the U.S. ever issued was a $10,000 U.S. bill? Did you know that USA is a top producer of corn, soybeans, rice, and wheat? Did you know that Pennsylvania is misspelled on the Liberty Bell? The Constitution uses one end and one section and two ends and another. Talking about Rhode Island, it is the smallest state in the country, 
but has the longest official name. It is called State of Rhode Island and Providence Plantations. Just in the last 200 years, America came up with some amazing inventions. Potato chips, condensed milk, electric light bulb, cotton candy, airplanes, aluminum foil, bandages, ballpoint pen, computer mouse, ice pop, electric traffic light, sunglasses, frozen food, chocolate chip cookie, disposable diapers, compact disc, laser printers, personal computer, cell phones, and much more. Talking about Air Force One, which is basically the president's plane, did you know it can be refueled in the air with the help of another Air Force plane? That means it can stay in the air indefinitely. It has speed of more than 965 kilometers per hour. It has an operating table and has an extra reserve of the president's blood type in a refrigerator just in case. It has two kitchens that can cater 100 people at a time. The president can deliver a national television address from Air Force One. The plane can also act as a bunker in case of a nuclear attack. The plane never parks at a terminal. When it comes, it stays where it lands. Basically, it's a flying White House with 85 telephones on board. And did you know there are two Air Force one plane president flies in either of the two. A nation becomes great because of its great people. And America is one such nation. All right guys, so make sure to subscribe to my channel and leave me a big thumbs up. Bye.